Hi friends, welcome to Tutors Funny channel. Uh, today I am going to teach channel creation part of the hospital management system. In our last class we saw the doctor creation part. Here channel creation part uh, done by the receptionist. So first if you want to create the channel, first you have to log as a receptionist. This is a receptionist username and password in order to log in the account. Select the user type as receptionist, click sign in. This one should be the receptionist, right? Here they will be able to create the channel and view the channel, right? Now what I'm going to do is here, uh, just go to the, go to my project. This is my project. Here I'm going to create the, uh, select the for my project folder and right click, new file. Here we have to create the, this one as a uh, channel, channel. This page as channel, channel.php. Right. I have created the page channel.php. Now what I am going to do is here, go back to my patient.php page. The same thing, control C to copy, the same uh, page control C to copy. And if you have to back to my channel.php, uh, other application, I am going to close it. Then you will easy to do the project. So all the things have opened, it's very difficult. Right. What is the relevant uh, pages you should open? Patient page and uh, channel page, right? Now here, patient page, we have to all the things, control C to copy, control V to paste here. Right, perfect, it's perfect. Now I, we have to modify the page as a channel page, right? Channel page consists of the, pa uh, consists of this one should be the patient uh, form. Here we have to change this one as a channel. So channel, this one should be the channel number. After that, doctor name, right. after that, this one should be the uh, patient name, after that we need a room number, this one should be the important room number is, now another one thing is we needed for the date, this is important stuff for the date, now see the copy, cannot read paste here, this one should be the date, but right. channel date. This one should be the required stuff, channel date. Right, that's the thing we need. Right, now what I'm going to do is here, here we have to change the form name as form channel. Right, this one should be the channel number, place order. We have to change this one as a channel number, C number means channel number. Control C to copy, control V to paste here. After that doctor name, this one should be the place order we have to change this as a doctor name. This one should be the D name. This also D name. After the patient name, so you have to write here is patient name. So the same thing, control C to copy, control V to paste here, this one should be P name. Alright, this one should be control C to copy, control V to paste here, right. Here, room number, this one you control C to copy. And already to paste here previous order here room number R number right this one should control seed copy can be paste here right that's it the final stuff is a date so we have to this one should be there we have to uh, paste order here to give us a date this one should be the date control seed copy can be paste here right control this is save right this is the page look like right now let's check of the page look like right now go back to my page as channel.php channel.php page right now here we have to check here the form should be fine display fine here it's display fine right here it's working well now what i'm going to do is here uh, i have to first i have to add here we have to change the field as a date field so we have to here you have to change this one as a date Type pass date. All right. Control S to save. Now let's refresh it. Now here it should be the date, right? This one should be the date, right? Okay, perfect. Right. It's working fine. Right. Now what I'm going to do is here. Uh, I'm going to first. I'm going to here. This one should be there. Uh, this one should be not a. Uh, uh, text box field we have to change the field as a combo box right we have to uh, 
here have to select the doctor name and patient name right before we have to uh, make the channel right so here we have to what I'm going to do is here we have to here do is here here as uh, you have to put it here this one should be the input this one you have to change this one as a you have to remove the stuff sort of that we have to write here is but right select select or select class form control id d name name d name uh, right d name right so we have right here is option value have right here like this so we have right select p select select right now what i'm going to this one you have to this one should be the patient the same thing control c to copy sorry control c to copy instead of the text box field you have to control with the paste here this one should be the patient name so p name p name right that's the fit right now let's check control s to save let's go here refresh it right it's perfect now we have to load the uh, doctor and patient right from the database so what i'm going to do is here we let's go to right now here what i'm going to do is here i'm going to go to the write the query for that so we have to write here this one should be the, all those things are uh, patient part so we have to write here is what have to do this one is so first one should be the uh have to write here first we have to create the function function get doctor when the form is loaded the doctor uh, the, for this function uh, won't load right so here we have right ajax Here we have right first type get comma URL. Now here I am going to give the URL. So let's go to the folder PHP inside the PHP folder. We have folder doctor. Here I am going to create the new page as get doctor get doctor dot PHP. Right now here what I am going to do is here go to the all doctor.php this page control c to uh, control a to uh, select all control c to copy uh, what i'm going to do is go back to my get doctor.php page control v to paste here right now here we have to do some couple of uh, changes here we no need this stuff this stuff we no needed we only we needed the this things right doctors uh, you have to need only these things select doctor name doctor uh, doctor number doctor name special this qualification from which table doctor table so we have to set the bind result here we have to get the values all the values here we have to sending to which page this page right uh, which page uh, this channel dot dot page page right so what i'm going to see we have to we we no need these values we only we needed the name only name and number only we needed so we it's no problem so let's save all and we have to go back to here we are only getting the page so you have to go here we have to type the url as here uh, simply you have to type php inside the php folder we have a folder called doctor inside the doctor folder we have file get doctor.php doctor.php right that's the thing we have to write after that what i'm a data type you have to write json comma you have to write another thing is a success function as a success function we no need to write here again by again we just uh, go back to my uh, this one patient or php we have to just success function we have to paste it simple we have to copy this one somewhere you can see the copy and to paste it and here to, to, to make like 
is right once you open you must close it here right here we have to get the result right and uh, now what i'm going to do is here all doctor we have to load and get the result here right now here we have to write what i'm going to do is first we have to uh, write a for loop for you have to create the variable i equal zero after that we have to write i less than data dot length here high plus plus right here we have to write yes we have to show which field all the data should be loaded and show which field we have to uh, show the field name is a doctor in this field right so here what i can proceed to copy this one this field right so this is the combo box we have to show the result all the doctors we load and show here so here what i'm going to do is here your right here is simple up right here doctor name right i copied that one so here i have to write append append you have to write here is append you have to write here option after that you have to write comma here we have to write open and close bracket right now here what i am going to do is here you have to write like this right that's the thing we have to do right now here what i am going to do is simply we have to write like this here we have to write uh, simply we have to write here uh, value data i dot what is the value you are coming here uh, get doctor field this one doctor number comma text here text we have to write here is uh, data i here you write dot what's the doctor name this one dd control c copy control v to paste that's the thing we have to do right now this function when the form is loaded it's get loaded control c to copy control v to paste now let's check whether it's working fine or not control s to save right now let's refresh it here what is the doctor's available these two uh, these are the doctors it will be here it will be show the records james and uh, and these are the doctors here available right here it's it's uh, displaying successful right it's working fine now what i'm going to do is see these are the doctors available it's working fine right the same thing we have to do the patient as well extra spaces we have to remove right now what i'm going to do is here we have to do the patient part for the same function control c to copy control v to paste here this one should be the patient get patient all right it's close to the patient page now what i'm going to do is here we have to the same uh, here we have to get this one this is a patient uh, dot php here we have to where is the patient right here right now here this one should be the patient page here this is a patient page this is a user folder right patient page i have put it here so here what i am going to see we have to go, uh, go to the main folder i click new file here all patient get patient now what i did is here uh, other stuff doctor and login and user all the stuff i have create one folder and put it in the files relevant files patient i didn't create it okay uh, you have to create when you are doing the project okay now i i didn't create it yet so here i have to create the file uh, get that dot uh, php patient here what i'm going to do is here go to the all patient dot php page here control c to copy this all the stuff all patient dot php and back to your uh, get patient dot php page control v to paste here here we have to do the stuff is we have to get the patient number everything right here so all the stuff are there what i am going to do is here 
this get patient dot php so we have to go here we have to go here we it is not reside on the php page okay so we have to get this is it is simply outside the php page so we have to just simply call get patient Okay, get patient here was the number patient number control c to copy control v to paste here patient name this one name control c to copy control v to paste here that's the thing we have to do right this one should be control c to copy this patient uh, also here to load right here after the doctor right that's the thing we have to do control s to save now we have to show the records on here as p name patient name so not here here patient name. what is the name of the combo box here P name, patient name control is to save now let's check here these are the patient right patient record will be there right these are the patient records this is the doctor right you will be able to select the doctor or who is the patient patient you will be select the patient name and room number and uh, book the channel date and click add the channel should be booked right now i am going to create the table for so add the records into the database so what i am going to do is go to the uh, my this is my database lay hospital uh, we have already created three tables doctor patient and user now i am going to go to create the another table for channel so here right channel uh, well, how many columns we have channel number one two three uh, four five right now here go here five columns name is channel right channel click go right now now the, here we have to first one should be the channel number ch number channel number ch number this one should be the you have to select as int with primary second one should be uh, doctor name d name doctor name here we have to uh, record added in, uh, instead of the uh, doctor name its id should be added so we have to write here is doctor number right this one should be the doctor uh, patient number p number doctor number the patient number right after that what i'm going to uh, add is after that uh, patient number doctor number uh, room number and channel uh, channel date room number r number channel date date right that's the thing we have to do you have select as watch our date right that's the thing we have to do now let's click save right now your table has been created successfully now here what i am going to do is first one we have to uh, set the auto increment path so i am going to set the auto increment path in my codes so here the code right here what i am going to do is see the channel uh, get auto uh, id this one here the function will be available now we have to change this one as a uh, this one channel so uh, i'm what i'm going to do is here i go to the my project directory this one i'm going to go to create another folder sorry select the php folder right click i'm going to create another folder this one should be the uh, channel right channel sorry not a file you have to get the folder channel right channel inside the channel folder i am going to create the another file uh, this one should be the first one should be this one should be the uh, auto id auto id dot php right. here what i am going to do is here go back to my uh, this one right doctor uh, auto id dot php go to the doctor inside the doctor uh, folder we have a file auto id dot php go there we just control c to copy the same thing control c to copy this one control v to paste here right 
is the pasty right right pasty right now here what i'm going to do is here uh, everything fine now we have to change here is uh, select max cars this is this this not be a doctor number instead of the doctor number you have changed it as a channel number so control c to copy this this one control v to paste here right from which table channel table channel right so channel table right so channel table right that's the task you have to give properly here right uh, after that everything fine right id and everything fine right now let's back to my uh this one channel this one right now let's back back here we have to give here as inside the php for uh, php uh, there will be the folder called uh, channel inside the channel folder we have file auto id.php right we have we created here and we already called here right now let's check whether it's working fine or not it's not working why well. is a problem to id call it right the problem is here let's call it here channel number this one c number right control c to copy control v to paste right you have to give the uh, text box which text box uh, it should display the auto number right i didn't give that's why it's it won't work so here we have to here it's working fine right now it's working right channel right this is the first time i am going to create the channel so it's 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, right now here we have to select the doctor and patient and uh, here we have to uh, select the room number here and we have to uh, channel date we have to select the channel date and click add button channel should book right so what i'm going to do is here uh, we ask the add right say add patient right now here what i'm going to do is here instead of add patient you have to change this one as a the all the fields are filled you have to change this one as a ch add channel right okay the same function control c to copy control v to paste here right now here what i'm going to do is this one should be the uh, form i'm going to change change it as right form, form channel right now here we have to change this one as a form channel right control v to paste control v to paste right it's goes to which page here inside the php uh, folder uh, we have a folder called channel inside the channel folder we have we have to create the file add channel right perfect right now let's check it's working fine or not right now what i'm going to do is here we have to control c to copy select the uh, channel folder right click new file and we paste here right we have created the ch uh, channel right channel dot php right now what i'm going to do is here i have to uh, write the insert code so we no need to write go back to my add doctor dot page page control c to copy the same code control v to paste here right now we have to change that stuff only right we no need this one login information we no need it this part we no need it right we have to can uh, we have to remove all the stuff now we have to only stuff we have to insert code on right insert into which table you are going to insert the record channel tables right so you have to write channel right channel table right now here what i'm going to do is here you have to get it here you have to write here uh, adjust the screen like this you have to write here ch number right after that doctor number d o c number third one should be p number p number r number this one should be room number finally date all right that's the field we have we remove the unwanted stuff this stuff we don't need it these are the fields available in the channels channels channel table right here we have to set the values how many one two three four five so we have to remove the extra one this one remove only five we needed all right 
Now here what I'm going to do is here after that, uh, these are the columns, you have to set this, all the stuff you have to copy, control C to copy, control V to paste below. Here we have to make this one as, all the stuff as variables. Right, perfect. Now here, uh, one, two, three, four, five, we have to five things needed. One, two, three, four, five. Right. That's the thing we have to do. Right. Now what I'm going to do is here. Here we have to sending the values to which stage at channel.php. This this is the form values, right? Uh, first one should be the this one. Channel number, this name control C to copy. You have to paste it here. Second one should be doctor name control C to copy. Control V to paste here doctor name. Third one should be patient name control C to copy. Control V to paste here. This one room number control C to copy. Room number control V to paste here. After that date control C to copy. Control V to paste here. Right. Extra things we removed. Right. Now here we have to channel number control C to copy this one. This variable, right? This variable you already equal it here. Control C to copy, control V to paste here. Right. Now here, what I did so far is, uh, we are sending the value into the this page, at channel.php page. We retrieving all the values, and we retrieving all the values. This uh, text box uh, combo box fields are retrieving here it's pass it's, it is assigned to the variable this this variables following variables we have to put it here it's call it here it goes to the uh, relevant column to add the records into the database right if you call right uh, that's the thing we need right now let's check whether it's working fine or not right now let's save our here Select the doctor James, patient Nimal, room number one, room number two. I just select as group number two. Today date. Click cat button. Patient error. Patient not patient. Channel booked, right? I have to uh, right here. It's all the things added, right? Here this one should be instead of the doctor name, add at the uh, doctor ID. Instead of the patient name, let's add at the patient number, right? Now here, that's the thing we have set it here, right? Now here, what I'm going to do is here. Uh, we have to the message. We have to go to the channel dot php. Right here, channel booked. 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 Right. Right. Okay. That's the thing we have to do. Perfect. Save. Right now it's working fine. Uh, now let's check. Now after the channels, uh, uh, if you if you add the channel, channel should be show here, right? Right. So what I'm going to do is here. I go back to my function get all function. Here we have to change the stuff. So yeah, how many columns we needed? One, two, three, four, five. Right. So. Let's go to the table. This is a table. One, two, three, four, five. Five columns. And we need another two. Another one. Six. One, two, three, four, five. This one should be the edit and delete. Right? This is the edit and cancel. Right? If you want to uh, cancel the appointment, you will be able to cancel the appointment. Right? If you want to edit the appointment, it will be able to edit the appointment. Right? Perfect. Now what I'm going to do is here. Uh, this one should be the channel. This table name I'm going to change as channel. Right. The same thing. You have to control C to copy the channel. You have to paste it here. Paste it here. Control V to paste it here. Control V to paste it here. Right. Now here we have to go to the uh, we have to show all the after add the records we have to show the all the records into the uh, J table. So what I am going to do is here go back to my uh, channel folder. I am going to create another folder all channel. Uh, sorry, I am going to create another file all channel 
dot php right so here what i'm going to go to the all doctor dot php page control c to copy this all the code and back to my all uh, all channel dot php page your page right now here we have to join the tables we have to uh, join three tables to get the result now here what i'm going to do is here the select query all the query we select and backspace to remove them these two things we no need that backspace to remove them right now here we have to write the column so select select right select first we have to this one right this table all the columns we have to join right uh, this one should be we have to create the object uh, as channel c dot ch number right ch number mean this one what is that you are written the column name here the same thing you have to give here right Sec second one doctor table we have to write d d name mean doctor name patient table p dot name right here uh, we have to match merge two tables so uh, d mean it's it's record is coming from the doctor table p mean doctor is uh, pay, record is coming from the patient table right here like this this is a patient doctor table doctor name look like this patient table patient name look like this name right same thing you have to write like this right after that what i am going to do is here comma uh, you have to write third one should be the room number so c dot r number right this is coming from the channel table after that comma c dot date right now here from first we have match channel table c join or a join keyword and we have to uh, join doctor table doctor object d on keyword here we have to write the uh, join right so c mean channel table object d mean doctor table object right c channel table object here we have to join together uh, uh, doctor number doc number channel table doc number equal doctor table we create the object d d dot doctor number right doctor number doctor number right you have to write like this right after that you have to write the joint keyword you have to write patient patient table patient p create the object p here we have to write patient p on keyword here we have to write c dot patient number p number equal patient table p dot patient number right this is how you have to join the table right patient table p we have to create the object c channel table p number and patient table patient number right i written like this right this one should be the not capital simple right right you no need right the keywords only we have to return the capital letters others are only not capital others are simple right so perfect now let's check whether is this code working or not select this all the codes control c to copy go back to my this database la hospital there will be the options to sql control v to paste here what, what you have copied click go right it's right here it's the, uh, all the things are is there right here it's working here so all the things are coming here right select channel number right the record is not there right it's working right now here what i'm going to do is here uh you have to set it to the relevant variables here first one should be a channel number right so here we have to uh here we have to write the create the variable channel number ch number right second one doctor na name right it's there third one should be patient name so we have to write here as a p name third one should be room number so you have to write or say r number after that it's date you have to assign date other stuff we have to remove them 1 2 3 4 5 right now here what i am going to do control c to copy control v to paste here right this is a channel second one this one control c to copy doctor name right this be there after that control c to copy after this this one control v to paste here 
patient name after that this room number control C to copy control V to paste here room number after that date control C to copy control V to paste here date that's the thing you have to we have to remove the extra things right that's the stuff you have to do right now let's save all right now let's back to my uh, page channel.php page here we have to set the values right first one should be this one th number control c to copy control v to paste here this one should be channel name the uh, doctor name control c to copy control v to paste here after that patient name control c to copy control v to paste here after that room number control c to copy control v to paste here this control c to copy this one control v to paste here this one should be there uh, this one date control c to copy control v to paste here date right here we have to write first channel number channel number doctor name patient name room number date All right that's it this one should be here uh, channel number control c to copy control v to paste here right that's here the title you have to change this one as a cancel right because here we have to cancel right here cancel the appointment you can cancel it here click on this button and cancel it right now let's check whether it's working fine or not now here we have to give the path right uh, when the form is loaded it goes to the path inside the php folder there will be the folder called channel inside the channel folder we have file all channel not all patient channel right now let's save all let's save all right now here uh, the result is not there here are the problems right now let's right here but right. here i'm going to add the record uh, james uh, doctor as james patient i am going to select as nimal room number one uh, here we have to select the channel date click add button channel book click ok here it's added successfully right now if you want to uh, second one we have to add the second one and d we have to john room number two channel date today date click add channel book it's added right it's working perfectly right that why the earlier record is not added uh, uh, record is not there that's why it's not loaded here okay? now it's record is available now it's here this is the doctor number patient number we have to join join the table right i hope you guys you understood the things well in my next tutorial i'll be continuing uh, the edit and cancel part you have to try right edit and edit uh, and uh, uh, cancel part i've already did, did it in my uh, patient part you have to try them right Oh, uh, thank you for watching. If you like my channel, please subscribe me, like me. Thank you for watching.